Yo, what's up? It's Trenton Sanderson. You tuned in to the Famous Living Room Network. Divine Power is always working for us because we doing right. So I'm just I was just sitting here thinking about some things, man. Uh, I know a lot of y'all out there that's probably tuned in and watching this video. You know, y'all y'all probably gonna be successful or very successful or whatnot. You have it. But um, I just want to let y'all know, man. This whole success journey, man. Y'all already know, man, it's a hard road. It's a long road. Uh, if a lot of people could actually do what you have already done, they would have been done, done it already. But the truth of the matter is they're never going to do it. Okay. As you can see, I'm a normal dude. I live in a normal place. You see my, you see my crib in the background. That's my bed. Yeah, I'm a normal dude. I literally was just, I had to take my phone um, case off my phone to record this video to put it into my um, gamble or whatever. Yeah, you might hear some laundry in the background, but I'm a normal dude, man. And uh, I've always been a normal dude. You know, I've always been the type of person to like look out for others and, you know, you know, being successful, I always try to look out for other people and try to make sure other people come first before me. Don't you feel like that? Like being a successful person, it, it always felt like this was not your life, but this was somebody else's life. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like you live your whole beginning of your life to like do for others and you learning and you going through the self-development process and this and that and whatnot. And then you get to a point, you'd be like, man, you know what? I'm going to start living for myself. So <laughs> ever since I've been started living for myself, man, I've just been becoming more successful. Like, but I'm about to tell you why people are jealous of you, man. Cause some of y'all probably uh going some of y'all probably going through stuff out there right now. You probably wonder like why people hating on me, you know, why people jealous of me, why people don't like me. The truth of the matter is, I'm gonna tell you the straight up truth. It's because you're becoming successful, you're becoming more greater. All right. It ain't ain't nowhere around this success stuff. Like if you if you wanna become successful, if you wanna have a million dollars, if you wanna become more greater, okay. If, if you want to move into that multi-million dollar mansion that you see in Beverly Hills, okay, that you see in Calabasas, that you see in Mexico, Cabo, Mexico, that you see in Monaco, right, that you see in Paris, Italy. If you want to live like that, you got to understand, man, everything around you is going to begin to crumble, okay? It's going to begin to crumble. And damn, that fish thing. I would, I was making some fish the other night, man. This thing so bad. Oh my god! When I walk downstairs, it's like, ugh. I know what that smell like. Oh, oh my god! I'm definitely have to take this trash out. Definitely have to take this trash out. But anyway, man, listen. When you becoming successful, man. When you becoming successful, people is gonna hate on you. It ain't. It ain't nowhere around it, man. People, people not gonna like it. I'm going to tell you why people ain't going to like it. People people is not going to like it when you are becoming successful, man. They're going to they gonna hate on you. They're going to dislike you. You know, they're going to discredit you. They're going to try hard to ignore what you're doing. You know, they're they, they, they going to they play. They're going to play. They're going to play what they call these mind games. They think these mind games. But you be seeing it. Like, you be seeing it. You notice it. You be like, hold on. What the hell? Like, why they, why they acting like that? And they know... They know good and well I'm great. Like they know I'm great. But why why they hating? Because you're great. Okay, you're gonna be in some situations. Some of y'all gonna be in some situations where you be with people that you, you love the most. They're gonna be your best friend. You're gonna be in position with people that you love the most. And then you wonder why she did that. Like why 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 he just act like that? Why he just told me to just get out the crib? And he ain't have no reason for doing it. Like, why did he tell me to just get out of his house for no reason? And we was just having a conversation. And, and, and I said, I spoke my mind. I spoke my opinion. And all of a sudden, he just said, get out of his house. Why did he say that like that? And you're going to try to you're gonna try to understand why they do the things that they do for they know not what they do. Okay? You like Jesus. You like When you become a successful, you like Jesus. Okay? People gonna try to crucify your ass. All right, people. Listen, when you when you trying to become successful, man, you shifting the whole paradigm in your whole family. 
you shifting the whole paradigm of everything that you ever knew. Everything that you ever knew already, everything that you ever knew already, it's like you take, it's like you saying, I'm gonna scratch that shit out, I'm gonna create a whole new project, all right? And that's, listen, and when you do that, when you do that, man, people don't like that. People don't like that, it is what it is. All right, look, I don't been through that already. I'm already successful. But I'm just trying to I'm just trying to tell y'all like what it's going to be like, you know, when um when you becoming successful and stuff like that, man. It's like, damn, somebody plumbing some damn Mexican music got side. Did I hear that shit? But anyway, man, when you becoming successful, man, people just people are just going to become jealous of you. Is is it it is what it is. But see, the thing you got to do is you got to be, you got to get, you got to begin to surround yourself around, you got to begin to surround yourself around people that's like-minded like you, like me. Like, I'm a like-minded person. That's why you watching me now. Because I'm a like-minded person. I'm on the same frequency. I understand you. Listen, if we was in the same place right now, I would definitely give you a hug. But since I can't give you a hug right now, only thing I can tell you is give this video a thumbs up if you agree with what I'm saying right now. All right? That's the only thing I say. Just give me a thumbs up to confirm in the universe that you agree with what I'm saying right now. But a lot of people, <clears throat> a lot of people send me email. They say, Trin, they say, Trin, man, man, why everybody treat me like this, man? Why everybody doing me like this, man? Uh, I ain't done nothing wrong, man. Look, when you become successful, man, people just hate you for no damn reason. Like, it is what it is. Like, like I told y'all yesterday, if you ain't subscribed to my channel, you need to subscribe to my channel, man. Hit the subscribe button and make sure you hit the bell notification. But like I told people yesterday, I was like, when you become a successful, when you become a successful in whatever field, whatever it is that you do, man, you can do one thing wrong. You can do one little thing wrong. One thing. One thing. And your friends around you, if they if they hating on you, if they don't really like you and, and, and love you the way you think they do, they will point that out. And they'll say, oh my God, look, your shoes, your shoe strings untied. Oh, look at her shoe strings untied. Look, look, y'all, look. <laughs> her shoe strings untied. And you be like, why, why is that a big deal? It's a big deal because you becoming successful. They're trying to be they trying to undermine you. They're trying to compromise you. Okay? They're trying to make you feel bad as best as they can because they already know that you are becoming successful. Okay, so they trying to bring you down to their level because in behind closed doors, they hating on you. They some fucking haters. And that's, the, that's just the way it is. They some fucking haters. Listen, if, if, if success was on a silver platter, everybody would be successful. Everybody would be Everybody would be successful. If success was on a silver platter, man, everybody would, would be successful. But everybody is not going to be successful because can't, everybody can't deal with this jealousy shit. All right. When you become a successful, you got to be willing to walk out in public places. People sneering up at you. <laughs> Girls, when y'all become a successful, you got to be willing to like be so pretty that you just got so much girls hating on you. They want to fight you and shit. They want to fight you. They, 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 they tell a lies about you. They tell rumors about you. That's what it's like becoming successful. That's what it's like to become successful. Y'all see me. I'm successful. People have been seeing me. I always been. Look, every everybody that follow me, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I'm walking around in my crib because I'm talking to, to y'all on this video telling y'all what it's like. But look, I always been successful, man. Listen, I'm by myself. Ain't nobody in this shit but me. You feel me? I'm by always most of most of the time. I'm always by myself. I'm never with nobody. They be like, Trent, why you ain't got no girlfriend? Trent, why you ain't got a whole lot of friends? Nigga, because I'm successful. Duh. A lot of people don't want to fuck with you when you're successful. It don't matter if you're a girl or a boy. It don't matter. A lot of people, you, and then on top of that, on top of that, you're going to start to feel like, shit, I didn't even want to hang with a lot of people because you already know most people ain't, ain't up to nothing, no good. You be like, yo, I'm not, I'm not even going to hang with these people. I'm not even going to hang with them because they not on my same path. They're not doing the same things that I'm doing. So why should I hang with these people if they're not doing something successful? Man, I travel all around the whole United States of America, man. All right, I be everywhere, man. Spot to spot to spot. Airbnb, Airbnb. I be everywhere, man. I got good reputation too. I be everywhere, cause I'm successful. You know what I mean? And <clears throat> 
the truth of the matter is, man, listen, if you want to become successful, you got to be the type of person, you got to be the type of person to be able to deal, deal with people that's hating on you, deal with people that's envying you, deal with people that's jealous of you. Because listen, you're going to see them with your third eye. People that's hating on you, even though they try to make it seem like they not really hating on you. Okay. Even though they want to do all kinds of guys, it's going to be a lot of girls that do you dirty for no reason. And you're going to be wondering, like, why did she do that to me? Like, like, why did she just leave me like that? Like, why? What? I mean, I didn't do nothing wrong with it. It's because she think you got a lot of women, but you really don't, bro. Like, because you're successful, bro. You got a lot of money. If you got a lot of money, you got things going for yourself. You got a plan. You got a vision. Girls is going to naturally, automatically assume in their minds that you are ha having other women. And that's why they're that's what they, that's why they're not going to be able to win you because they they assuming things too much is not true. That's why you're going to get a wife. You're going to get that woman that come to you that she know what it is. She's successful just like you. You know what I'm saying? She's doing big things just like you, okay? Them stragglers, what they call them, what they call them little thoughts and stuff like that. They're not gonna ever. They're not gonna ever be able to be with you, bro, because you're successful. Okay, when they see you got a big crib, big car, flashy car, they see you got a lot of money and stuff like that. Man, they're gonna say, they're gonna say, damn, he got a lot of women. I know he do, girl. I know he do. I know he got a lot of women, and they ain't even gonna have no evidence to prove it. They just gonna say it because they not trying to shoot for the same things that you shooting for. And since you shooting for something great, they're gonna just say he's bad because he's successful and that's sad as fuck and that's really why i'm making this video because people get jealous man because you've been successful like all my life growing up man all my life growing up everybody always everybody always said trend man you get rich you be successful you be positive go to college get your degree man you a good dude you're gonna be a good dude man you're gonna be a, man that's good that's what the that's what america wants that's what the world wants. That's the American dream. I went to college. I didn't finish college. You know what I mean? But I did the best that I could to my knowledge. You see what I'm saying? To my knowledge that I had at that time. Listen, you can only go with so when, when it comes to the success stuff, you can only go but so far according to how much knowledge you got or how much knowledge you've been taught. All right. And so, you know. Growing, like I said, growing up, I was taught that if you be successful, you be positive, you're going to have all the friends, you're going to have all the girls, everything's going to go right for you. But that's just totally opposite of what it really truly is all about. When you get when you become successful, it's a lot darker. It's a lot darker than what you really thought it was. You're going to start to really find yourself. You're going to start to really find out there's a lot of people ain't there for you like they said they was. There's a lot of people that you love the most. Some of your love, some of your loved ones, your family ones, your family ones, your 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 relatives, they're not gonna even like you no more. And you're gonna notice it. You're gonna see it in their fucking face. They can't hide it. You're gonna see it. You're gonna say, damn, I did not know they didn't like me like that. Like, damn, like they don't like me because I'm becoming great. Because I smell good. No, they don't like you because of that shit. I'm telling you. Success is not what people think it is. It's not. Success. It's not what people think it is. It's not what people think it is. People think it's all like Teletubbies. 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 Say hello. I'm Poe. I'm Tinky Winky. I'm Dipsy. La la. Poe. Nigga, no. That shit ain't that happy. It ain't that happy. Success is a dark path. And I know this is not what you want to hear. But success is a dark path. When you when you want, when you decide in your mind that you're gonna be successful, and when you are becoming successful, you will see a lot of negative things around you happening. Now, here's the good part about it all: if you are able to get past the obstacles, the adversities, and the roadblocks, and the haters, and the instigators, and the pessimists, and everybody that won't and want you to compromise your plan, and they, they they want you to go downhill because they see you are becoming greater than them. When you get to that point, when you can oversee all of the shadows and the illusions, then you will become even more successful. See, this is that's the thing about success. You can continue to level up and level up and level up. Some of y'all want the big house, the big manor house on the hill. 
<laughs> with the big backyard so you can invite your family over and throw barbecue cookouts and stuff in with a big yard with two acres on it. Be like, look what I did for y'all, family. Look what I did for y'all. Yeah. Some of y'all want that. But you're only going to get that when you're able to level up from the success that you're at now. Remember, success is forward progress in motion. So you have been progressing forwardly the whole time, ever since I can re remember. All right, you've been subscribed to me, right? Make sure you subscribe to me right now. If you haven't subscribed to me right now, I'm Trenton Sanderson. I'm your life coach. I'm your boy. Star Seeds, living in a star sea world. I'm in, the, I'm in the air conditioner right now, so you ain't got to turn it on, as you can see. I'm really about to go out, be honest with you. I'm about to go to the seafood restaurant. Give me some fish and some seafood, uh, some shrimp. And I smell like time for it, boy. Straight up. But, um, yeah, anyway, <clears throat> back to what I was saying, though. Who was I saying, y'all? See? Where they do that at? Divine powers are always working for us because we doing right. But now, seriously, this is what it's like to become successful. It's like... It's a lot of people that become jealous of you, man. They, they, they just get jealous. They get jealous, but you already know negative energy don't have power over positive energy. Not at all. Negative energy don't have power over positive energy, okay? And the only reason why people hating on you and they jealous of you because they love you, but they hate you at the same time. It's some people that really do love you. They love you from the bottom of their heart, and they copy your style. They copy your swagger. They want to be just like you. But at the same time, they hate you behind closed doors because they cannot be like you, okay? It's called jealousy, all right? It's love and hate at the same time. But you gotta understand, when you a star seed living in a star seed world, you are the light. And the darkness must come to the light, trust and believe. So you are a natural born leader, okay? That's why they are jealous of you. But listen, don't get it twisted. Everything is always going to work out for you. Everything is going to happen in your favor. God got you covered at all times. Don't worry about it. Divine power is always working for you because you're doing right. God got them haters under control. Trust and believe. But anyway, I thank y'all so much for tuning into this video. I'm about to get up off of here, man. I just want to let y'all know, man, if you becoming successful, just know what you're getting into. Um, this ain't no, this ain't no, this ain't nothing for the chickens. This is for the eagles, okay? Listen, if you're an eagle, you can't listen to chickens, all right? So if you've been finding yourself being a leader, you know, and, and protesting, shouts out to all the protesters out there, <laughs> and, and, and taking journey and, and making things change and men different, from everybody else being the outcast, the Andre 2000, just know that you are becoming successful and everything is always working out in your favor. And 2020 will be your year that you become successful. As a matter of fact, I got a video right here. I think I, said, I made a video yesterday about becoming successful in 2020. Check that video out. Check the other video out. Make sure you subscribe to my channel by clicking my face icon up there. And hit that bell notification so you can be notified every time. I upload new videos like this one right here every single day. I'll see y'all in the next video. Get on my get on my video. P, get on my video. Now